And participants, for your information, I would like to share uh, with you that the Institute of Constitutional and Parliamentary Studies, in coordination with the Parliamentary Research and Training Institute yes. of Democracy, we have received overwhelming response across the country, and we can organize many more. Honorable Speaker of the Lok Sabha, Sri Om Birla Ji, Honorable Minister of Home Affairs and Cooperation, Sri Amit Shah Ji. Honorable Minister of Parliamentary Affairs, Sri Prahlad Joshi Ji. Honorable Minister of State, Parliamentary Affairs, Sri Arjun Ram Meghwal Ji. Home Secretary, Government of India, Sri Ajay Kumar Bhalla Ji. Additional Secretary, Prasenjit Singh Ji and Officers of Pride and ICPS. Officers of Central Government, State Government and Legislative Assemblies and a large number of agencies and organizations participating physically and in the online mode today. Members of the media, ladies and gentlemen, namaskar. Let me take this opportunity to extend a warm welcome to Honorable Speaker Lok Sabha, Honorable Home Minister of India, Honorable Ministers, dignitaries, participants, media persons to the inaugural session of the 12-day training program in the specialized field of legislative drafting. This program is being organized in the Parliament of India by the Institute of Constitutional and Parliamentary Studies and the Parliamentary Research and Training Institute for Democracies. The training program is being organized under the directions of Honorable Speaker and has been conceptualized and curated under the inspiration of Honorable Home Minister. I have been given to understand that Honorable Home Minister, while serving the state of Gujarat, had an exposure to a similar training program, which was then being organized by ICPS at Mavlankar Hall, New Delhi. Honorable Home Minister, sir, had found the training useful and therefore we are extremely happy to put together an orientation module in consultation with the Ministry of Home Affairs. Ladies and gentlemen, as the Indian society becomes more literate and aware, and the economy gains in complexity and size, and as is perhaps inevitable in our rapid march towards attaining a developed country status, the demands on the system as a whole for comprehensive, well-conceived, well-drafted, and sophisticated laws will keep growing. It is a well-held truism that a legislation is as good as the drafting. Many a times, a good legislation can come to grief on account of imperfect drafting, and the consequences can be serious in that the legislation will fail to deliver the intended outcomes to the stakeholders. Such poorly drafted and ambiguous legislation can place avoidable burden on the system in the form of disputes, litigation, and harassment, besides causing loss of time and money. Since central government, state government, are primarily mandated to draft bills and rules, it is absolutely critical that officials who are responsible for carrying out this very important task understand the basic principles and the nuances of legislative drafting. It is therefore extremely heartening to note that, it, that in addition to central ministries and agencies, a large number of participants, at least 80, are joining us from the states. Honorable Speaker, Honorable Home Minister, sir, I would like to assure that between today and 26th of May, participants from central ministries, state governments, and related organizations will be exposed to more than 25 sessions on various aspects of legislative drafting, including one on the approach to artificial intelligence. 
I'm happy to inform that we have invited as faculty eminent academicians, senior advocates, and practitioners well-versed in this field to provide participants an all-round perspective. I'm sure participants joining us in physical or online mode will benefit immensely from the course content and in turn will be able to serve all intended beneficiaries, stakeholders, and the country better through well-drafted legislation. Once again, a very warm welcome to you all in the Parliament of India. Thank you.